Not sure what to do with all of your leftover syringes? Why not turn them into a fully functional AK-47 BB gun? No, really. That's a thing that exists because YouTube has given people the power to do literally anything if they have the time and resources for it. This creation comes from the mind at the Blackfish YouTube channel, and it starts very simply with one plastic syringe tube that's altered a bit and filled with yellow BBs. It only takes a few seconds and a little glue for the mechanics to start coming into play. The very first thing built appears to be a feeder for the BBs, which would direct them right into the barrel of the syringe AK-47. Do you ever look at something and wonder why it exists? Don't get us wrong, we're incredibly impressed that someone had the know-how to create a functional AK-47 BB gun out of syringes. But why do they have that knowledge? At what point in life does one teach themselves how to build such a gadget? How did they calculate how many syringes to use, and how to cut them perfectly to build a gun of all things? Whatever does lead one on the path to this unique creation, we're pretty happy it happened. Though the bulk of the BB gun is made out of syringe tubes and glue, there is a bit of wire work required to make the motor run. What we maybe like most about this gadget is not just that it works, but that it does very closely resemble a classic AK-47. Even as he's piecing it together, you can see the different components of the fully auto BB gun come together to create the well-known firearm. The AK-47 is a Soviet-made rifle that was first designed after the end of World War II. The first model was produced in 1948, and the rifle has been in production ever since. Despite being a Soviet weapon, the AK-47 has made its rounds and has been either utilized or recreated by nations like the United States, Poland, Pakistan, Iran, China, Albania, and Cuba. This syringe model of the AK-47 is pretty accurate to the original design, right down to the subpar accuracy and messy bullet spread.